Blue Peach, and this is uh, Tanaka. Okay. Congratulations. Asante sana. 450 times to the top of Mount Kilimanjaro, to the roof of Africa. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Asante sana. Karibu sana. Asante. Hope to see you in 151 times. Yeah, again. <laughs> Maybe it is not true because I'm too old now. Katika geti letu la marangu, tuko pamoja na Mr. Rudy, ambaye ni kiongozi wa wageni au tuwa leader, ambaye amefanya kazi ya kuleta wageni na kuwapandisha katika kilele cha mlima Kilimanjaro kwa miaka 30. Alianza kazi hii mwaka F1-1982 na leo ametimiza miaka 30, lakini ni mara yake ya miyamoja hamsini kufika katika kilele cha mlima Kilimanjaro My first time I, when I climbed Kilimanjaro this was like uh, 1982 So I came here I was alone I want to climb this high mountain and this was really hard My first time was really hard because I, I carry everything I cook by myself I have only the guide with me and I was too fast so this was like amazing for me I was really good in sport but this was really hard to get to Huru Peak this was wondering for me. So next time was more than 10, 20, 10 years later, 12 years later, I come again with a small group. It was only friends, you know, from my village. And from this time I start the business uh, climb Kilimanjaro. Amekuwa kifanya kazi hii kwa kuleta wageni mara zote 150. Kwa hiyo tunampongeza na tunawa encourage watu wengine eh, au viongozi wengine wanaoleta wageni basi waweze kuweka rekodi zao eh, kwa kupanda mara moja na zaidi ya idadi yaliyofanya Mr. Rudi. It's now 30 years I do uh, 150 times and for me it's like Tanzania is like my second home now, you know, and this mountain is like <laughs> my favorite mountain. I, I, I never done uh, a mountain so often in Austria than Kilimanjaro here, you know. So this like a lot of people are wondering, you know, why I can do this so much. So, but I like this. I like the people here. I like the nation. I like the nature here. It's, it's, it's amazing, you know. Kilimanjaro is a uh, mountain what have everything you know you start like in the in in a in a in a uh, tri area you you go up to the glacier so uh, no other mountains on the around the world have the same nature like this mountain here we went to kilimanjaro with rudy um i saw it on the internet that there is this group of people that we can go up to the mountain and it was always a dream of mine to to go to the highest point of africa to kilimanjaro um, so I booked it and the trip, it was really awesome. So um, the, the, the agency, they booked the flight for us, they booked all the, the, the cars and the transportation for us, the hotel and all the, the huts over there. So it was really well organized. Kwa tunampongeza sana sisi kama hifazi ya taifa Kilimanjaro kwa hili jambo jema na amekuwa balozi mzuri ambaye kila kishuka kutoka mlimani amekuwa akitushauri nini vya kurekebisha na mawazo yake na tumekuwa tukiyafanyia kazi hivyo amekuwa ni msaada na balozi mzuri wa mlima wetu na hifadhi yetu ya Kilimanjaro. It sure is something different you know it is there is uh, much more huts up there even you know and when you go some attendant routes it's it's better you know with the toilets and everything electricity they have here but what i have seen is here uh, even the nature is changing you know much it's really much changing, you know, because the glacier is gone very fast now. And when you, when I be 10 years ago, a uh, little bit more than 10 years ago in Horomba, I said the altitude from 3,700 meters, now it's get, it's warm, you know. Before, when I wake up in the morning, was ice everywhere. This, I never see this the last 10 years. So it's a lot of changing. 